Hello guys, this is Shazi from Textinators.com. This is Blender 3D tutorial in which we are going to see how to perfectly UV map a sphere. This is a quick tutorial, so without further delay, let's start it. So first of all, let's find a texture to be UV mapped on a sphere. Okay, so this is the texture that we want to UV map onto our sphere. So let's go to Blender and remove this cube and create a sphere. Go to Mesh and UV Sphere. And when you zoom in, you will notice that it is not a perfect sphere. So there are two ways to enhance the shape of this sphere. Firstly, we can go to this menu and increase its segments to almost 100 and also increase its rings. Yeah, 60. And then go to this menu and click smooth. Now you can see it is a perfect sphere. Now go to edit mode by pressing tab on keyboard. Now to UV map the sphere, let's change the layout of this editor. Go to this menu, click UV editing layout. Now in this window, let's open up the texture that we just downloaded. Click open. Now the texture is open here. But you cannot see it clearly because there are so many panels in front of this. Now go to the other panel and press U on your keyboard and select Sphere Projection. Blender 3D is smart enough to automatically adjust the edges and all the faces accordingly. Now to see how it looks in the real time, go to this menu and click Texture. Now you can see it in the real time. And then deselect all the edges by pressing A on your keyboard. Now you can see it in the real time, but it is not very clear from this angle. So this is because of the lighting. So let's go to the object mode by pressing tab on your keyboard. And then let's delete this lamp. Now zoom in and see in the real time. So that's how you UV map a sphere. Okay guys, that's all for today. If you like it, please give it thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me. And if you have some question or you're having some problem, just comment it below. I try my best to read all the comments, whether they are on my blog or on my YouTube channel or anywhere on the social media. And I try to answer them as quickly as possible. So, See you in the next video. Bye-bye.